I'm awake and it's not four o'clock in the afternoon, but I'm still fucking tired. Cut the camera too soon because I just did a stretch and farted. Fuck, did that feel good? All right, let's get this fucking crock pot out. Put the beef into it, some potatoes, some carrots, some other shit. Let's fucking drill us meat in there. It's gonna be awesome. All right, we got a big lump of meat. We got our carrots and potatoes in the bottom. Let's go ahead and plug this fucker in, set her to high, and walk away. That's all she wrote, people. We'll come back and check on her every once in a while. Mom told me, do not, for under any circumstances, lift the lid once you set it. So, it's set. It's good. We'll let her do her thing, and then we'll come and check on her in a bit. As for today, I also need to take a rip over to my parents' house, drop off that present, just waiting for dad or mom to call me and let me know she's back from the mall. And because Oreo likes them, I got a carrot for him. Nom, nom, nom. I don't know why he likes carrots, but he loves those fucking carrots. So give him a carrot every once in a while. It's good for his brain, I guess. Because Lord knows he's got a little brain in that peanut head of his. Alrighty, well, we got to head over to my parents' house and drop off that present so that moms can wrap it. So let's pitter patter and have at her. Can't believe a couple days ago it was minus 20 and today it's minus zero. Fucking climate's all over the board. So dicked. Well, it's been about, let's say about an hour and a half since I put this fucking thing in there. And uh, it's hard to see with the lid on, but I can't take the lid off, which she's giving her. So right on. Do something she told me to do for my gravy is take the juice out and add some Bisto to it. Problem is, I don't have any Bisto, but she does. So I'm bringing a container with me and see if I can steal a couple spoonfuls. <laughs> Alrighty, car's fired up. Let's get the fuck out of here. Go drop this shit off and uh, come back and veg, I guess. Alrighty, people. Just came from my parents' house. I dropped off the gift. Mom will get rip wrapping that all up for me. And success. We have the Bisto. Got some sad news today. Fucking bullshit news. Fucking cancer once again takes another one, son of a bitch. Fuck cancer, fuck it right in this dirty ass. Uh, my union rep from when I worked at Ontera passed away from brain cancer a couple days ago. It's fucking bullshit, man. Cancer's a fucker. Fuck cancer, fuck it right in its dirty ass. Mom hooked me up with some Bisto here. Should be able to get that gravy nice and thick, hopefully. And uh, the roast is still roasting. Of course, all that water formulated along the top, it's hard to tell. But uh, yeah, she's giving her. This is going to be a good fucking dinner. Anyway, I feel like another coffee, so I'm going to grab my cup. And we're going to rip off another coffee. Because why the frig not? So, yeah. Sorry to be a Debbie Downer there with that news. Fucking shocked the shit out of me when I heard about that. Because, uh... I honestly never knew anything was wrong with the union rep. I thought uh, everything was copacetic and next thing you know, I hear news like this and I'm like, what the fucking hell? That's the problem with cancer, eh? She sneaks up on you and last thing you know, you're diagnosed and then she just fucking spreads like wildfire. Son of a bitch. Holy shit, it reeks of awesomeness in this house right now. All I can smell is, it smells like Sunday dinner. Smells so good. All I can smell is beef cooking and potatoes stewing and carrots stewing and my fuck is it ever awesome. Oh, I, I gotta take a, I, I don't wanna take the lid off, but I didn't know any better, I swear. Oh yeah, look at that, she's fucking boiling in the bottom, eh? Look at that. Look at that. That is fucking fantastic. Oh, it's gonna be so good. I'm gonna rip myself off into the coffee. You gotta go outside? Oh, he does. He's giving me that derpy look with his tongue out and stuff. Have another kafafi. And, yeah. Been, uh, last night when I went to Walmart, I bought a bottle of this stuff. Coffee whitener, uh, French vanilla flavored. It's not the brand I normally get, but I thought I'd give her a go. It's not too bad, it's actually better than coffee, mate. I guess the next exciting thing to do with that beef is gonna be trying to cut it. I don't even think I have a fork to take it out of there with. Mom used to use this like long fork-like contraption and I don't think I have one so we're gonna use two regular forks and try and lift it up onto the cutting board and 
Cut it with a serrated knife, I guess. I don't know how the fuck I'm gonna do that. Oh well, however we do it, it'll get done and it'll be fucking delicious. Alrighty guys, it's time. I just tried to pick the friggin' thing out of here and she fell apart. Chunk him out of it. Oh, this is gonna be some good shit. You know, I could almost make this into a stew and it'd be good. Okay, so we got potatoes, we got gravy, we got carrots, we got two hunks of beef. The rest of the beef is in the fridge and the rest of the gravy and shit's still in the crock pot. It's time to go eat. This is fucking looking awesome. I forget I love crock pots, but I totally should have made a stew. All right, well, we just got done playing Ark. We didn't stream tonight because I wanted to tame dragons. And who the fuck wants to sit there for four hours watching a guy tame a dragon? And I heard a loud crumble downstairs and... Yep, sure enough, it's my beer bottles. Fucking cat. Ugh, for fuck's sakes. Why can't I have nice things? Because I have a cat. Yeah, I just didn't think you guys would be interested in watching a bunch of dragons. We got uh, two blues and a red. And that was fun to get those eggs. Let me tell you a little something about that. It wasn't easy. The other night I set up an incubation area and a, a leveling den and all that and a milk farm. And today I put it all to work. And five hours of real time later, three dragons were born and were able to fly them. Holy shit. Anyway, I need to fire up my laundry. See if it's all in there. Looks like it, so let's go ahead. Get that going. Grab this. Get this in there. I need like a, a, a drone for vlogging. You know? Like this this robot that follows me around and gets the shot while well, I have both hands free for like doing stuff that'd be so fucking cool I need to invent that but it needs to have hover technology because we don't want to listen to well it's like fucking droning around well I guess I could just wear a mic yeah I have like a bluetooth mic on it and it just follows you around it's like getting the shot aiming at your face all the time and so that would be cool, you know, except when you're trying to take a shit and the fucking thing's banging into the bathroom door because it wants to get the shot. That'd be annoying. Oh, frig sakes, guys. I did something I should have done a long freaking time ago. Gave myself a shave and a haircut. Yeah. Kept this thing. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. I don't look like that guy anymore, though. Where is he? Yeah, I don't look like that guy anymore, though, but that's all right. I feel a lot nicer right now. The heat's escaping from my head. Life feels good. But I'm going to do myself a solid and go ahead and shut the vlog down here, people. And edit this all up and get it up to YouTubes. It's, uh, what? Oh, yeah, okay, that makes sense. It's 3 in the morning, so I'm going to call it quits and get to bed. So thanks for watching. Like, favorite, and comment. Don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, people, keep on vlogging.